Hey guys, Longshot here, and today we're flying the Viper. Uh, the mission that we're going to do today is a low-level flight and a low-level strike. So, in this video today, I'm going to brief you guys in the beginning, uh, just so you know what it is that we're doing, and then it's going to be a little bit of a more cinematic view, the way in, the strike, the way out, and hopefully some air air. So, the mission today is we there is an illegal arms show happening to the northeast of Damascus. We're gonna strike that because we cannot allow it to happen. We know there is some bad guys there, so we're gonna strike that. And afterwards, uh, we're gonna uh, get out from the area from the same coverage, low level. And we do know there is two MiG-29s on alert and they are waiting uh, at Damascus currently on the ground. So we're gonna take advantage of that. And we know that they're gonna scramble after we strike, so we do expect to meet them on our way out, but we wanna meet them on our own conditions. So after we are uh, get out from the SAM coverage in Syria, it's gonna be approximately over Lebanon, we're gonna to climb to high altitude in order to engage them BVR style. So we will have the advantage. This is the game plan, I'm gonna show you the waypoints in just a second, and let's get on with the video. Okay, so we're gonna take off from Ramad David. This is the first, uh, it's waypoint zero. Then we're gonna go to Hula Valley. We're gonna maintain low level underneath the Golan Heights in order to not be discovered by the SAM sites in Syria. Over, between waypoint two and waypoint one, we're gonna uh, turn our lights off right there and we're gonna master arm on and then we're gonna fly low level all the way. Waypoint two, waypoint three, both of them are just showing us uh, the topography over there in, uh, to fly uh, low level. There is a creek and a valley, big valley over there. Waypoint four is the break into Syria. It's a hard break, uh, right turn into Syria. We're still gonna be low level. Waypoint five is gonna put us directly on the path that we want to drop our bombs because we have only one shot so intelligence gave us the path that we need to drop the bombs waypoint six is a target and then we're gonna push out toward uh, waypoint seven which is right here this is where we want to go high altitude in order to engage those mix
Okay, we're just across the Israeli-Lebanese border. We're going to maintain this ridge line to our right uh, in order to provide cover from uh, Syrian radar. Light's going to go off and uh, Master Arm going to go on. It's going to be low-level flight in the valleys. It's going to be more cinematics. Hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so here we are at waypoint 5. That waypoint is going to put us on the right path to deploy the bombs on the targets and the way that the targets are deployed in the field, the distance, uh, the direction, everything. Uh, so we're carrying the Mark 82 Snake Eyes. Those bombs has fins and those fins will be deployed once we hit the pickle button. Those fins will create more drag on the bomb uh, in order to give us room to uh, make way to not be hit altitude. from the blast. That allows us to drop at really low altitude, but there is some dangers to that because you're more vulnerable to ground fire, uh, like uh, you know all those guns, those uh, shilka stuff that they can put on the ground. Uh, you know, not everything is a win-win situation, but uh, it does allow us to surprise the target and fly really low. To avoid those SAMs as you can see right now. Okay, 
We got one missile launched at us. I'm not so uh, scared of it. Uh, we can drop really low in a second, and uh, this missile will not be able to track us because I'm gonna be so close to the ground. So I'm gonna get low right now, and the missile will not be able to track me anymore. I'm gonna line myself on the target uh, to the target directly as intended uh, by coming from this waypoint five directly to waypoint six, which is the target. And I'm gonna get ready. Pickle. Okay, I think we got good hits on the target. Yep. Okay, now we're gonna stay low and push out of the SEM area. I'm already uh, in air-to-air -air mode, uh, getting ready to do those uh, scrambled MIGs. We're gonna stay low and push as fast as I can in order to climb to high altitude once I'm gonna be over Lebanon so I can engage those MIGs and, uh, in my conditions, BVR. Okay, this is the ridgeline that separates uh, between Syria and Lebanon. Uh, after that, we're gonna we'll be able to see the Baka Valley. My game plan is to fly low level here and cross the Baka Valley, and in the next ridge after the Baka Valley to the west, uh, I want to climb up. I hope I'll be able to do that in the time that I got. Altitude. 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 Okay, this is the ridge line, and after that ridge line, we have our waypoint that we want to climb. I hope they will not get here soon. I don't think they have me on radar yet. Uh, but Altitude. once I'm gonna get a radar warning Altitude. from them, basically this is my key to climb Altitude. up and uh, start engaging. Oh, there we go. This is a radar warning. Let's climb up. Altitude. Altitude. Okay, now I'm in altitude. I reduce the climb a little bit in order to uh, not lose so much speed. I want to be over Mach 1 when I'm going to engage them. Uh, that way the missile will not have to break the sound barrier and it will be more uh, lethal that way. So I'm going to turn into them right now. Okay, now I'm gonna start look for them on the radar. I can see them on the RWR, but I want to lock them up on radar uh, to engage them with those AMRAMs. All right, there we got the two. I'm gonna lock both of them up and gonna launch uh, on both of them at the same time. Go Fox three times two.
Okay, now I lost him from RWR. Oh, there we go. One splash. Let's see if I can see the other one. Yeah, there we go. There's the other one right there in the ridge line. Yeah. Okay, splash two. We're heading back home. Good job.